Hey guys, Lance here. Another uh, cold day in Indiana. Hope you're all doing well. Hello. So, uh, got me thinking. Got a few minutes here. Let's uh, help you guys out with what you can do indoors on these cold days. And uh, I want to show you a tool that I like to use that I picked up uh, at the PGA show about a month and a half ago. Uh, it's called the Well Putt Mat. It's about 11 feet in length. And uh, so let's see how it works. Let's give it a go. So see, we've got various spots, alignment tools here on the mat. We got 10. As you can see, I got my alignment sticks and my uh, arc mat here, just past six feet. And then you can see I got a couple golf balls lined up here at three feet. And then of course, there's the cup. And then the orange and black zone, that's called the good putt zone. As you can tell, it's about foot foot and a half behind the cup and that's generally going to help us with our speed and our feel if you can get it in this zone here you can usually clean up from there uh, after if you do miss and take no more than two putts on the green so so what I'm going to show you here I'm going to start with uh, the two golf balls here at the three feet mark and I really want to talk about just striking the ball solidly and a couple things we can do to help with that on the greens. I think that's overlooked. A lot of the times we don't think of striking putts solidly and then uh, we'll, we'll put strokes on it where we're decelerating or we're coming out to in or we're hitting the ball out on the toe. We're getting a lot of spin and skipping on the golf ball. So here are a few things I like to do and I hope they help. First off, you notice my golf ball I've got two marks on it. Okay, the vertical line, that's the line I want to start my golf ball rolling end over end on towards that cup. Okay, we want a nice tight end over end roll. And as you can see, the horizontal line, that kind of is going to indicate my face awareness, how I like my putter face lined up to the golf ball. And we want a nice centered set there behind the golf ball so we can take a nice motion through, striking it in the center that putter face nice and solidly and then accelerating to the cup here okay as you can tell on the well putt mat this is going to aid you in your stroke length there back to the line it's going to aid in your face awareness and then also your acceleration point there keeping the face going right towards that cup here so you kind of see how it works I'll give it a go here and short but anyway that's kind of how it works so you know you're probably thinking okay no well putt lance well no problem okay so you can take the alignment sticks find a nice area in your home and set the alignment sticks up on a nice nice carpeted area with some speed and you can still set the golf ball up exactly how i explained before vertical line aimed at your intended line to start the ball on and we got our horizontal line again and then the alignment sticks are kind of going to act as a gate it's going to help with your putter path okay so you can do that at home and you can kind of create your little makeshift good putt zone as you can notice I got a club back here behind the cup and that's still that foot foot and a half zone so really promoting good speed good feel because I think along with a nice solid strike on the golf ball you want to have a good feel good speed I think a lot of folks get caught up in alignment and then they forget to hit it and miss a lot of putts because of that so again this is how I work when it's cold out well putt mat if you have any questions Feel free to leave me some comments here on Facebook or email me, lance at lancegolf.com. So that's a little quick lesson. Thanks. Talk soon.